Hello everybody, this is All Souls Gaming, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Dredge. In the previous episode, we decided it was time to head to the southern, uh... If it would let me zoom... No, nope, this is zoomed out as I can get. Uh, that it was time to head to the frozen south to investigate the area. And, of course, there's something eldritch and horrible going on, as there is with everything around here. Wherein it seems a captain has sacrificed two of his crew members to some elder god for, as usual, power. Because what else would they be doing it for? But, we can set these guys free, including the one who doesn't want to be, but I will be doing it anyways. Break the ice. Silence. It. You must shatter. Yes, yes, I know. You strike hard against the center of the shard where the shadowy shape appears darkest. A deep crack chases upward, cleaving away fragments that fall and shatter. Hmm. Structure peels open, split to its core. A glistening stone lies cradled in by broken shapes, wispy threads of starlight trailing from it. Frozen heart, a brilliant crystal of pure ice, gossamer filaments of radiant light drift, fr yeah, drift from within. You take the stone and leave. Alrighty then. Well, seems we need to keep gathering these ice picks, which are... More than likely hidden within the, uh, areas filled with ice. Alright, there's another, so that's one more individual we can free. Huh. Ah. Translucent ice stretches down to the darkness. A pulsing glow rises from the deep, illuminating four round sockets. Well, at least we know where these go. And I may as well mark that. This leads out of the frozen sea. That also leads out of the frozen sea. So let's just head back the way we came. What the? Oi! What the hell happened there? Ugh. Used hoist. Well, I don't think I'm gonna need that. This area is, at least appears to be purely ice fishing. Okay, maybe I should dock here and rest until morning, so I can at least see what's happening. So this thing really does swim around. Thing is, there's no feeding spots for it. At least none that I know of. Guys, uh, when I saw someone else play through this, this thing never showed up again. Break the ice. 
cold sun, long warmth long forgot, or warmth long forgot. No more, break me. You strike hard against the center of the shard where the shadowy shape appears darkest. Deep cracks chases, a deep crack chases upwards, cleaving away fragments that fall and shatter. And another eye closes. Structure, yeah, stone lies cradled. Alright, and the last ice axe should be here. Or at least the last as far as I know. Which, as we know, I know very little. Head for the central camp, and then I guess... Once we get that one... Oh. There's a feeding spot. Guess that's one we can use ad infinitum. But it doesn't seem like he's around right now. Mm. Boat swing. Gone. Fearful boy, the skies, we remain. The consequences, inherited. Huh. Navigator, my eyes for the shadow. Closing. You risk annihilation. Annihilation. Can't break the ice. Do not risk breaking its senses through the ice, through the shadows. No hope. You strike hard against the center of the shard, where the shadowy shape appears darkest. Deep crack chases upwards, cleaving away fragments that fall and shatter. And one eye remains. Yep, another one of these ice hearts. Take the stone and leave. Alright, well, seeing as how this narwhal is going to be a problem, let's catch some fish. I'll leave out on the ice. Ah, dang. Would have been nice to sell, but new. No. Huh. I wonder if it'll accept that. Actually, I wonder if I even have enough for that offering. Nope, I am one short. Seems to have satiated it for now. So I guess it doesn't need to be full. Uh, what's this? Ah, it's the way south. then. Right, 
another ice axe. And this. What have we got here? The spire of glass ice stands in the shadows of the cliff. Across the water, a monstrous visage peers from an icy tomb, placed near to the ice. The sound of anger lashes from within. Murder! Betray your men! Left us here, your sleepless god. The voice abates. Wait. Your shadow. It speaks. Another shape. Please save us all. Find the axe and do the this. The betrayer. Who are you? First officer. Safety of the crew. Failed them. Should have cursed place. Find the axe. Undo this. The betrayer. What happened? The men saw lights. Southern cliffs. At night. Captain and I would look into. We rode alone. He was restless. Sleepless. We passed. Walls of ice. Finally arrived. The great horn. Into view. The words dripped in. Some carried away on the wind. Was pulled ashore. Quickly. The size of it. The light. Somehow. He knew. His eyes were wild. He was... Whispering, answering, he said, it chose him, alone, avert my eyes, could not help, look upon, we fought, cold hands, an iron grip, breathless, find the axe, undo this, the betrayer, what is that thing in the ice, shape of the, in the ice shrinks into itself, I know not, the eyes open, watching, shadow of shadow through ice, yet more, closed still, cannot arise, Break the ice, cull the heart. Find the axe, undo this, the betrayer. Must not fully awaken. The eyes, close them, strike the heart. You strike hard against the center of the shard where the shadowy shape appears darkest. Deep cracking and chases upwards, yada yada. Final eye closes. Something new for us to fish up. Structure peels open. Yeah. Frozen heart. Take the stone and leave. Aureus Anchor, a fragment of golden splintered horn. Discordant buzz fills the surrounding air. It yearns for the deep. Cast this overboard to create a reusable two-way portal to Blackstone Isle. Well, that probably would have been a lot more useful early on. Heck, I could have used that to get back to the Iron Rig faster. And that's almost everything here. Just one other thing we gotta finish. <sighs> no. Here it is. This way. Glowing white intensifies, feeding into the four stones. And the eyes finish the main quest in the pale and yeah. A web of light grows between them, connecting, rejoining, uniting. A radiant trawl net. Install time for us operates. Uh, 18 per day, 7 out of 7 capacity. Ice, coastal, oceanic, and shallow. Strands bend, blend through hues of the aura. A gleaming trap of light in, do in the dark. Menacing spikes of ice adorn a basalt frame. Send those two to storage. And you know what? I don't think I really need this anymore. Oh, 
toss that in the cargo, because I for because apparently I had accidentally sent them to storage instead of selling them. Alrighty then. Well, may as well remove that marker. Then I guess we're gonna head around to the merchant. Tell her about what happened. Assuming there's an option to do so. Always the last one. Bell Reach is done. See under the ice, use of strange stones, icebreaker was constructed. Find more tablets. It seems like there's space for a couple more. Let's see, oarfish, goliath, tigerfish, coelacanth. Oh, I forgot to mention, just let me know if you want to temporarily remove that icebreaker. I can swap it out at any of my pontoons. No, I'm, I'm good with it. What's this? Looking through the schematics we found before, and there are plans for another device, too. They're for an ice shaper. That's different for, to your icebreaker, by the way. It's for cutting chunks of ice. If you find the missing device, I'll be able to use the machine to harvest ice blocks for refrigeration. Mm. Blocks of ice can be packed into your cargo to slow fish spoilage. Pretty handy, mm. right? Here's what's missing. What the ice shaper's missing. Or missing ice shaper looks like. Okay, well, I, I don't think I really need that. Matter of fact, I've reached a point I don't really need to worry about fish spoilage. Honestly, this is probably something I could have tackled a long time ago, but... Yeah, well. Mm. Alright. Find the ice shaper. Eh. Alright, well, seeing as how we're not going to be doing any ice fishing anymore, I'm going to uninstall... No. Yet I need to be in the shipyard mm. to sell it. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to install the infused coiling rod. And I'm going to buy the heat resistant line. As I'll send it to the storage. And then I'm just going to make the new one, because I've already got the other things and I just needed the fishing rod. At the, uh... Iron rig. Alright, may as well make our way there now. All we got left is this. There are some of the other pursuits I could try to go after. Stay away from me. I know what you are. Stay away from me. Looks like it's given up a chase. I eh, got enough cash. I hope. Really? Also, I forgot to hit up the little marrow to sell off the... Yeah, oh, well.
And there we are. We basically have enhanced fishing for everything now. It would actually be cheaper to just make one of these to repair my hull than it would be to go to the... Hmm. to go to the undermarket. Yeah, I was working on a heat sink. Yeah, why not? I have the cash for it. Hmm. Is there anything else I was working on? A real accelerator? Yeah, why not? Let's get another heat sink. Hmm. And I guess with that taken care of, I can just toss these things back in storage. Okay, then, so what was it that we needed samples of? Let's see, Twisted Strand, let's see, it's this thing, Opabinia, Borets. I know a couple of these I've found in you know, a crab pot, right? That one's gonna be the big pain. In which case, I should probably have the <sighs> Undermarket. Alright, may as well get to work and try to catch those fish. Actually, you know what? Let's get some rest first. With the heat sinks, we can go a lot longer with haste before it becomes an issue. Eh, should I bother? Nah. Yeah, yeah. Alright, time to head into the mangrove. I uh, may as well cast the crab pot over here. I just hope enough time is spent that some of those fish that we were fishing up for the, uh... Here we go. The cash were, uh, regenerated. Boreal shell. Cold wind blows through the skeletal flame, condensed into the light of a ghostly aura. Oof. Alright, anyways, gotta keep going around to the various... Spots of slick. Maybe I should have kept that uh, siphon trawler thing. If for no other reason than to get through the uh, slick easier. Yep, this is one of them. Let's 
discard that. And let's catch a little more. one of them and the other one is just the crab pot fish also forgot to cast that thing overboard Let's see resembling gargantuan fang tarpon this prehistoric predator is known to eat prey the size of a human hole yikes all right well let's return some of this to the iron rig And then we can sell off the rest of the bio generator. Well, what was that? Anything here at the. No, nothing at the crab pot. honestly, I keep forgetting that I can sell stuff at the bio-generator. Also, while I am here, let us cast this overboard. Morse Anchor placed. Portal is now available. That, that is that one, and that is that one. We just need the Nipponitis. Ah. Hmm. I wonder, was there anything... Well, of course, it'll mm. be cutting edge. Mm. See, that's just for dredging. Mm. <laughs> yeah, no, it doesn't seem like it. We are just about out of time. Ah, but it makes our panic go up immeasurably. Which is fine. I can work with it. Now this time, let's sell this junk off. Instead of just, you know, sending it back to storage. Cash for gold. Sell a total of 1,500 worth of trinkets. Huh. Wonder, can I? No. Oh, that's right. I sell it off to the trader. Right. Well, let's head back. Then we'll probably end it off there. Because my guy could use some sleep after that. Okay, well, hopefully by the beginning of next episode, I will have the crab pot sample that he wants. Hopefully. And then we can move on to the devil's spine for that last little bit. But anyways, with that, if you guys like what you see, please leave a like, subscribe for future content, don't forget to hit that bell icon to get notifications for when I upload, and please, leave a comment down below this video. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks 
for watching.